guys welcome back to my channel today i am going to show you what is in my suitcase and do a come pack with me so if you're interested in seeing what's inside my suitcase then just continue to watch so dangerous i get this right hi everybody if you're new here welcome my name is juliet i'm a mom of two boys and i'll do three videos a week on all sorts i do lots of hauls and fashion and beauty and lifestyle videos so if that's the kind of thing you're interested in there is a little subscribe button down here in red somewhere if you did want to click that and stick around it would mean the world to me it's completely free and entirely up to you but without further ado let's get into the video so today I'm going to turn the camera around and show you what is in my suitcase. I'm going to Cyprus for one week. There's me, my husband and my two boys. Leo is five and Lucas is just coming up to 18 months and we are going to Cyprus for a family wedding. So I thought I would show you what is in the suitcase of mine because I am really minimalistic when I go on holiday, what I try to be, what I believe is minimalistic. So I'll show you what I take and then I hope that it helps give you some inspiration your holiday. Okay so I've put everything out nice and neat for you so you can see everything I'm taking away and I will take you through it. So these are my packing cubes which I will probably show you in my packing hack video that is going to be going up but I am taking this white bikini which is from Primark. Um, I bought that in a previous haul which I will leave linked below. A plain black bikini. This is another Primark bikini which has got cream and rose gold. This is a leopard print one piece and then this was also a bargain bikini from Primark. I think I paid like three pounds for that. So all in all I'm taking one, two, three, four bikinis and one one piece and that is literally all my swimwear there. This is like a little bandana just in case my parting burns. Um, shoes wise I always am really um, minimal with shoes. So I've got one pair of heels one pair of like dressy nighttime flip flops these are from primark um these are from primark as well actually then my havanas just some plain black ones and then also my beautiful I've got a mark on there and then also my beautiful primark sliders which i have already worn a bit around the house because i love them and that is all shoes daytime outfits i have this i will show you these so this is just like a really cute lace kimono this was from river island last year i absolutely love this so i'm going to take that then i'm also taking this lacy number so it's pretty much the same it's like a halter neck dress like it's got high neck at the top this was from primark last year i think it was only like 10 pounds or something and then i'm also taking that little so this is just a wrap this was from I think that was from Primark last year and then I've just got two pairs of Primark shorts there and then this is just like a jumpsuity kind of white linen thing that'll go as well then I'm going to take my two pairs of sunglasses that I bought from Primark and my favorite as you all probably know my favorite um going out bag which I know that a few people have had trouble getting so I'm really sorry about that I've also got my hat that is from Primark this is what I'm traveling in so I'm just going to be traveling in my cream Primark joggers and then this is that like an oversized cream jumper that I'm going to travel in with probably like just a strappy top underneath okay pajamas wise I'm just taking two pairs of shorts and two of these really nice cute cami short crop tops from Primark and then also these those cream you can see that the cream shorts and top that I bought from Primark as well, like their bridal range. I absolutely love those pajamas, so I've saved them for holiday. And then on to outfits. So I'm taking these really cute collots. These were in my Primark haul that I did recently, and I'm taking those with like this little crocheted top. I just think this is so pretty. I bought this from Primark last year. I'm definitely a bit of an advocate for Primark, aren't I? <laughs> then I'm taking my mum shorts, which I absolutely love. And I've got this little top. Now, this is either to go with it. This might be more daytime, I suppose. I haven't worn this yet. This was from Primark. It was only about £3. So I'm taking that. But also those shorts, I'll be able to wear these on a night time with, with this. So this is like, I bought this in my last haul. It's like a cream bodysuit, lace bodysuit. But I'm going to wear this for the wedding with this really nice satin pink skirt. That's also on my previous Primark haul. I've got this really nice co set, so I'll show you this. So this is a 
long skirt see if i can show you so it's like a really nice long wrap over skirt and then it goes with the same crossover top yeah and that was from new look um couple of years ago now but i absolutely love that then i'm going to be wearing this if you haven't seen this dress where have you been um so i got this on my last primark haul it's what's in the thumbnail of my last primark haul video it is just this really cute yellow flowery dress this was just 10 pounds from primark and i have to say i fell in love with it i wasn't sure when i first bought it but now i love it and then this dress here is one I had from Pink Boutique, um, which is a really nice online boutique that I really love. And it's really beautiful. It's like got no back in. It's kind of really difficult to show you, but it's got a high... I'll see if I can insert a clip of me wearing it, but it's got like a high neck and it crosses at the back. And then it's got a nice slit up the front. So I do really like this dress. I love the colour. And then moving across then for another night or daytime again, this is like a really beautiful off-the-shoulder bardeau top that I bought from Primark. This was only like, I think, three or four pounds. I really, really love this. And I've got this to go with... Um, these beach trousers and these again are from Primark I think everything's from Primark but yeah these are just really nice they're quite see-through so they're more like beachy but to be honest I'm happy to wear them out with some decent underwear underneath and then finally I've got this top dress now this dress I have had years now, these dresses that doesn't look that nice off but when you put it on it is beautiful so i love 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 this dress and that is pretty much it for clothes i mean it looks like a lot but these are all just one outfits there's hardly any clothes there really i'm a really light packer because i've just learned over the years there's no point in taking things you're not going to wear so i like to try to organize the outfits i'm going to wear and then that's all i take at least then there's no deciding when i'm on holiday as well so just moving over here onto like toiletries now this is where the bulk of my toiletries comes so i'm going to decant some of these into little bottles but i'm going to take my purple shampoo which is the fudge shampoo which i always use i get this from amazon and then i bought this from poundland i'm going to take this a decant a bit of that as well and then this is the conditioner i always use and it's the three minute miracle it's more of a hair treatment but i love this for holiday especially if your hair dries out it's so good then i always take a foam burst because i just love foam burst and it doesn't really weigh a lot either a tube of toothpaste my tangle teaser and then a pack of razors now i might not take all of these i'll probably only take maybe three um but yeah i got these from home bargains in here i've got my nipple flowers i get these off amazon as well um yeah i just take loads of those because i don't really wear a bra on holiday i'll probably only wear the one i go in and that is it and this i take mouthwash i take a big one of that to be honest because me and matt both use it i've got my perfume which is my fantasy which is my favorite this actually this headband is from primark I'm taking that as well um, i'm also taking my zala tape solvent so this is what i use to take my extensions out i'm taking this just in case i have a disaster with my extensions and I need to get them out i'm taking that with me i also take this aloe vera um it's kind of like an after sun but it's really good for burns like if you burn your shoulders or whatever so i really like this it's about four pound from home bargains um, I'm taking this Tresemme Platinum Strength. This is kind of like another leave-in treatment if your hair does go really dry. I do really like that. I'm going to take my Skinny Tan Pro Tan because I don't know how quickly I'm going to tan because I haven't been away for so long. So I'm going to take a fake tan just in case it gets to the wedding and I'm a bit pasty. But I am taking my Skinny Tan Protect and Glow and these do have a gradual tanner in them. So I'm thinking I might not need this but I'm still going to take it just in case. But I've got um, two 30s, a 30 lotion, a 30 spray, and then a 50 lotion and a 50 spray. So I'm taking all of those. And I'm also taking this 30 scalp protection spray as well. I'm also going to take my Skinny Tan Moisture Hit um, because I just love I've got sent these products and I just love this, the smell of this. So I'm going to take that away with me as well. But also my Old Faithful is... Um, my cocoa butter so this is amazing it's from home bargains it's only 89p i think it smells amazing and we use the whole tub while we're away it's just i find it better than after sun and it smells beautiful too um, then I've got my makeup bag, which I'm going to, I don't really take a lot of makeup on holiday. I'm probably just going to take a couple of bronzers, my eyebrow powder, 
and my mascara and some lashes but that is literally all i will take but i'm taking this more for the bag because i bought this in my primark haul the other week and um i just love it i just think it's so practical so i'm going to fill that up with like my toiletries and take that with me and then i'm going to take a pack of baby wipes so when i'm on holiday i tend not to use like makeup remover and stuff like that because it's just too much to take everything i literally just take baby wipes which is really bad of me i know and then finally, I just wanted to show you this. So I'm not going to go through all my electronics and bore you. But I bought this off Amazon the other day. I will link it below. It was only $9.99. And it's like just this little cute little speaker. And I thought that was so nice for holiday. Um, you know, because it doesn't weigh a lot. It's inexpensive. But to take it by the pool and like just have some music on holiday. I just thought that was really cute. I really liked that. So yeah, that is going with me. Yeah, that is everything I'm taking with me on holiday. Um, that's what's in my suitcase. I don't really, like I say, I'm not a heavy packer. There are a couple of things I haven't shown you. Like, I do take a few, like, paracetamol and stuff like that. And I'm taking my Lilo and i'll take my ghds but i don't really take anything else with me i i am a very light packer i always think it's best to just take what you need because when you've got two kids to take as well you don't want to be carrying too much stuff for yourself so that is all i'm taking for me and i reckon i'm going to be able to get everyone's clothes in that suitcase that is my mission this suitcase by the way if it was from matalan but it's an it luggage suitcase so it is quite a, a nice name and i absolutely love them i've got the mini one to take as well which will have all my toiletries in but i think it was about 70 or 80 pounds really big and i love it i think it looks so smart and matt's got like the black and brown one to match um but we're only, i think we're gonna get all of ours like mine matt's and the boys in one suitcase that's the plan thank you ever so much for watching i really hope you enjoyed this video if you did don't forget to give it a thumbs up and i would love for you to subscribe and stick around and until next time guys take care Bye!